Hello and welcome back to another episode of Animal Crossing New Horizons. I spent a little time yesterday after I ended my recording. Oh, here's Tom Nook has something to say first. Sorry, sorry, Tom. Testing, testing, test, test, test. <laughs> Hello, every... Oh, dear. So sorry about that. The volume was a little loud there. Also, the volume's a little loud here. There's a garbage truck going by outside. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can hear that. Okay. Hello, everyone. Starting today, I'll be doing an island-wide broadcast full of island updates, goings-on, and such. Hmm? I'll go over some things that are very important to island life, so lend me your island ears for a short time. Now, it's only fitting that we kick off this daily ritual with a doozy of an island announcement. Oh, great. The Turtle Time Airport is now open for business. Starting today, you can use online or local communication to fly to other islands for a visit. This means I can go fly to my husband's island and pick up all of the stuff I've littered his island with. That's not all. No, no. The airport counter now offers postal services. I'm really lazy about sending letters. And just like the resident services center, the airport is open 24 hours a day, so please do drop by for a look. Oh, I do have one other item to share, and it too is a whopper. Hmm? Could it have to do with a certain little owl? Yes, yes. As of this very day, a brilliant fellow by the name of Blathers will be joining us on Turtle Time. Blathers has a keen interest in biology, past and present, and he's here to study Turtle Time. I sincerely hope everyone lends their cooperation. Inquisitive residents should stop by his tent for details. That's all for me. I do hope you'll enjoy another fine day of luxurious turtle time living. So as I was saying, I spent a little time off camera last night uh, gathering some fishies and buggies just to get the Nook Miles points. I, was, I managed to get the 5000 needed to pay off my loan uh, and upgraded uh, my tent to the first house. Okay, I guess Tom has another announcement. <laughs> okay, it's 12.24 this happy Wednesday. October is here, and that means it's Halloween season, and what would Halloween be without pumpkins? It's a little late for me to be planting pumpkins. Oh gosh, I just realized I don't even have a costume for Halloween. I didn't even think to bring one. Oh, poops. Oh well. <laughs> If you're interested in planting pumpkins, the time has come, well really, and gone, to get started. Yes, yes, Leaf will be selling his pumpkin starts at a special price throughout the season. Not to be outdone, Timmy will also be offering pumpkin starts for a limited time. Plus, Timmy will be selling candy through Halloween. I suggest you stock up before the big night. Well, that will be easy to do because I only have two villagers as of right now, so I don't really need a whole lot of candy. You just never know what kind of Halloween mischief you'll need to ward off with some candy. Oh ho. I'm also looking forward to see everyone's costumes. Well, hopefully, uh, Mabel. Yeah, that's her name. Mabel will show up. Be sure to have your costumes ready before Halloween. Yeah, um, I may have to come to somebody's island. Hello? <laughs> Help? <laughs> I have a no costume. That's all for me. Time for you all to get out and enjoy your day. It's quite rainy. I actually really love the rain, in-game and in real life. Probably because we just never get enough. So as you can see, yes, I got enough uh, Nook Miles to pay off my first loan. I have my little starter house. Uh, I picked the blue roof. Let's see what mail we have. Nook Ink. All new body paint and eye color. Great. I'm saving up first to expand my pockets, which is, I think, 8,000 Nook Miles. I'll have to see how many I have. Oh, got Jack's uh, post. Uh, I'm guessing it's his poster. We could hang up in the house. Aw, Mom, what did you send us? 
Whenever I see a plane, I think of you and wave at those airborne strangers with all my might. Aw, Mom. You're so sweet. <laughs> As I throw it away. Oh, and I uh, had uh, a few bells to spend, so I bought a KK album. Happy Home Academy. Congrats on your new home. Look for more messages from us as you hone your home decorating skills. And a housewarming gift is attached. Yeah, they'll be judging me harshly, I'm sure. Okay. Yep, Jack's portrait. Aw, thanks for the apples, Mom. Soulful KK. Great. As you can see, I managed to craft a flimsy axe, got a little wood, made a watering can. So let's put some stuff I don't need into storage because <laughs> bag space is at a premium right now. Oh, you might have already seen my fancy new feature in my house. Uh, yeah, turn on lights, open storage, I know all of that. Don't always hit the right buttons, but I do know it. I was shaking some trees last night, and in addition to getting stung by a wasp and learning the medicine recipe, I shook loose a, shook loose, shook loose a toilet. We're actually going to keep it. Okay, I'm going to put that in storage. I did not like that song. So we'll put that over there. So I'm going to keep the toilet because I will probably accidentally eat some fruit at some point. Let's hang Jack's portrait. Oh wait, let's just do it this way. It's just easier for me. <laughs> and Let's um, you know what, I'm going to get rid of my cot for now. And hopefully we'll be able to craft a little bed soon. Okay. Oh, <laughs> see, I know how it works. I just always hit the wrong buttons. I wanted to turn off the lights so we could see the glow. Okay. Put you in storage. Don't need you while it's raining. Let's, let's learn wooden mini table. Oh, cute. We'll make that. And what else? We're going to put that in storage till we have a record player. I'm going to put the apples for mom in storage for now. Not really going to be planting any of those. Let's see, we've got some Nook Miles. Oh, for our dream house. Oh, nice. We're at, yeah, I'm doing pretty well. I'm back up over 5,000 Nook Miles. So not, not bad. Not close to where I was on my old island, but not bad. Oh, it's a cute little table. Okay, what other, what other furniture? All right, cute log stakes. We'll need those for a bridge. All right, let us... Oh, let's go see Blathers. Um, like I said, I was doing a little bug catching and fishing last night. So I have, I think, 15 specimens to give to him. Oh, let's say hello. Hi, Renee. What's the latest? This island's got a ton of foods I've never heard of. I'm trying to come up with meals for as many as I can. Okay. <laughs> oh, and Leaf. We'll visit with Leaf in a little bit. And Tom Nook gave me some flowers. I can't remember now if they were Cosmos, and so I've planted them. And we are going to go look for Goose. Go look for Goose, and then we will talk to Blathers. Here's my message in a bottle. One nice thing about restarting the island is I can actually use these. They will be recipes I most likely don't have yet. From Barbara. Oh, Rose Crown, cute. All right. Oh, there's Goose. <laughs> Hey, uh, Bakay, you good? <laughs> Let's talk. I'm not feeling this rain today. I'm going to stick to indoor workouts. Well, you might want to go indoor for that. Indoors for that. Oh, let's see if I can get this snail. 
I would hope so, but I, I swear. I, I don't know what it is with me and bug catching. If you can do it wrong, I find a way to do it wrong. <laughs> okay, let's go pick... Oh, my money spot. How much... Ooh, I can plant 10,000 bells. Let me... I don't have the, uh, the uh, shovel DIY yet, though, but I will be getting that. So let's get this stuff to start turning in. How much bag space? Okay. Three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. His little tent is just so sweet. I wish we could kind of keep that as part of the museum, you know? Somewhere on the island have the regular museum, but this little tent just at some little site. I know there's a room in the museum that kind of represents this, but it's just not the same. A pleasure to meet you. My name is Blathers. I am exceedingly interested in the ecosystem of this island. Thus, I have come to conduct research, if you will. Could it be that you are Moxie, the person personage who chose the location for this tent? I am? A splendid job indeed. Thanks to you, I was able to alight on this island with nary a ruffled feather. Now regarding the aforementioned research, truth be told, I am determined to open a museum and henceforth dwell on this island amongst you. Well, I am determined for that to happen as well. There is one smallish problem regarding said museum. That is, I lack the number of exhibits needed to secure permission to open a museum proper. Well, I will help fix that. Empty display cases will not do. You see, it is not only insects and fish I plan to display in my esteemed institution, but fossils too. As it happens, there sits a substantial stretch of land beyond the river. Now, if only I had a vaulting pole and a shovel. Hmm. <laughs> I have a solution as audacious as trying to populate an entirely deserted island. Excellent. He's going to give us the vaulting pole DIY. Oh good, and a shovel for fossils. Cross the river and seek out these ancient relics. My feathers, I've blathered on far too long, but let me leave you with this. If I'm to open the museum, I must acquire more items to exhibit. Fifteen more, to be precise. I think I have that. I fervently hope you will donate your precious finds to the cause. Yes. If only I could do them in batches and not one at a time. What would you like to donate? Let's start with my snail. He loves bugs so much. <laughs> the horror, the repugnance. Good heavens, I must maintain my composure. Still, there's much I can tell you about the insect you apprehended, if you insist, that is. I will be nice, Blathers, and not make you suffer through that right now. Okay, let's give you the rest of these guys. I do have more. Let's see what next. What's next? Oh, a long locust. He will enjoy this as much as the snail. <laughs> there have been times when I have made him tell me about insects just to torture the poor little thing. <laughs> I won't do that today. Any hoot. My sincerest thanks for your donation. Yes, yes. Yes, I've got something more. Let's give him a fish right now. <laughs> Don't want to scare him too much with bugs. Mm, not right now, thank you. I'm a bit busy. I have to get out there and start digging fossils. Here is a sea bass. Uh, no, thank you. Uh, 
I have more, yes. Here is... Oh, sorry. Gonna give you a little cricket. <laughs> yes, I know you detest them. I'm so sorry. Oh gosh, I almost said, please tell me. I don't think any of us want to sit through <laughs> those lengthy descriptions right now. You may have a butterfly. Now see, how could you even find a butterfly, Wretched? They're so pretty. No, thanks. It's fine. <laughs> I do have something more. Well... Since you didn't like the butterfly, I'm going to guess you're really going to hate the dragonfly. <laughs> How did Blathers get into the museum curating business to begin with, with his dislike of so many creepy crawlies? <laughs> Yes, just a few more things, Blathers. Here, have a horse mackerel. That's less creepy. No, thank you. I'm still a bit busy. Still need to get out there and do some digging. Oh, yes, yes. Let's see. Ah, a dace. No, thank you. Yes. Here is a tilapia. No, thank you. Still busy. <laughs> Still kind of in a hurry, but, you know, I'll just keep giving you things one at a time. I do have a few more things. Have a lovely bell cricket. I know you're going to love it as much as the butterfly. Oh, God, don't hit. Please tell me. Okay. <laughs> I do. I do. I have one more item in my bag. Have a nice little olive flounder. No, thank you. Just three more donations. I have it. This is very exciting. And it didn't take me very long to catch those. I was hoping I'd catch a um, scorpion. I think we still have scorpions. And it's after, is it after November 1st? It switches to tarantulas. Couldn't quite remember. I think I already gave him the dragonfly, didn't I? Whoops. So let's get this catfish and whatever these two things are. <laughs> Couldn't tell without my glasses on. <laughs> Hello again, Blathers. Make a donation. Okay, yeah, I did already do the dragonfly. Here is your catfish. No, thank you. Still a bit busy. I do. I have two more things. I'm sorry. They're both bugs, but here, please have a common butterfly. I think it's pretty. 
You do not. <laughs> no thanks. Yes, yes, they'll get the best care, thank you. Yep, one more. You can have a big stinging, stinging, <laughs> I can't speak again today, wasp. Just like the one that got me last night. I might agree with you that these are wretched things. No, I'll spare you of telling me the details about that as well. Hmm, I do believe this means... Yes, huzzah, hooray! We have acquired the number of specimens required. My feathers, I am at a loss for words. Never would I have imagined we could reach our donation goal on this, my very first day on the island. The generosity that made this possible, the passion, I am humbled by the spirit of turtle time. <laughs> now we can submit our application to build a proper museum. Oh, oh my, I must make haste and prepare for the museum opening. There's so much to do. Hootie hoo. Thank you so very much. Thank you, Blathers. I can't wait for your museum to get here and then we get to have it upgrade again for the art gallery and all that good stuff. And I'll have to tell you, for somebody who doesn't like coffee, because I really don't, I am very excited about the arrival. I'm just looking for some shells. I don't know why. I guess I just want to sell them. For the arrival of Brewster and his coffee shop. I think that's just such a really cute, sweet idea. I've not played any of the other Animal Crossing games in the past, but I have watched some... Uh, oh yeah, I've got to go make that shovel. Um, I have watched footage of uh, New Leaf and uh, I forget some of the older versions of the game. And it, it just it looks very cute and fun to have Brewster in the little coffee shop there. Okay, I need the hardwood for the shovel, which I can do. Uh, and I need five softwood. Let's uh, shake some trees, but we'll use a net this time. I don't feel like getting stung again. What's sad is I will forget which ones I have shaken and which I haven't. We'll just. Oh. I guess if we spank that tree, maybe it'll drop some acorns, and it didn't. Oh, that one did. <laughs> so we'll just do those right here in front of the museum. And then start chopping some wood. I bet my axe is going to break because I used it for a bit before I logged out last night. How much wood do I need for that pole again? Five soft wood. So we're just going to go till we get that. Oh. <laughs> called it. <laughs> okay, what do I need to craft a flimsy axe? I have everything I need for that. Okay. <laughs> oh, it never fails. Oh, let's read our bulletin board. Halloween party news. October 31st is Halloween and we'll be kicking off our festivities at 5 p.m. sharp. Yes, yes. I hope to see all of you there and don't forget to bring candy. I will bring the candy. I have to remember to go buy some right now. Oh gosh, and I have to get stuff from Leaf. There's a lot to do today. Oh. What are you guys chatting about? Ah, we need to build a shop. However, when it comes to building supplies, our customers' homes should take priority. I have every confidence that you'll find a way to handle this little puzzle. The two of you have been training under me for how many years now? This should be a piece of cake. Well, hello there, Moxie. Are you happy with your home? Is it meeting your expectations? I bet you'll be a lot more comfortable now. Houses are so different from tents. Yes. That's the main reason, is for the built-in storage. 
All homeowners are automatically registered with the Happy Home Academy. The HHA, as we call it, will evaluate your home on a regular basis. Yeah, helpful advice like your furniture should all be the same color. You shouldn't have cockroaches. They're so picky. Oh, which brings us to your new home loan. That'll be 98,000 bells, please. Well, what Tom Nook doesn't know <laughs> is I have about 14 million bells, something like that, just sitting on my husband's beach. So I will be stuffing that ABD machine full when, uh, before the end of the day. Oh, great. Nook Miles ticket so I can start traveling with the airport. Go meet some new characters or gather materials. I have to admit, too, I also cheated. I have, like, a couple of stacks. I think two or three stacks of all the crafting materials, so I'll be able to get the shop up and going as well. Um, probably just going to wait for my husband to get home later and open up his airport. Okay, Timmy has a bit of a proposal, so if now is not a good time, I understand. No, it's a good time. Very good, I'll get right to the point. I'm hoping that you might be interested in collaborating on a new venture, building a new shop. Yeah, yeah, I would love to build the new shop. Okay. Building materials are hard to get, so can we set them aside for building a shop? I really don't see it since we'll need those materials for residential projects, but I have an idea. You could gather materials from around the island, right? From the trees and rocks? Our environmental review even suggests that there will be zero impact to native flora or fauna. Ah, but I'm getting off track. We'll need a lot of materials for a proper shop, and we will, of course, offer compensation for your efforts. Sure, I'll help. Thank you so much. Now I know this is a lot, but I put together a list of the items I'd like you to gather. We'll need 30 pieces of regular wood, hardwood, softwood, and 30 iron nuggets. I'm not concerned about where these materials come from. They could come from this island or any other, and you can gather these materials at your own pace. All right. I'm gonna sell my dragonfly, clear up some space in my inventory. I'll save the little acorn. Now I'll have two <laughs> for crafting if I ever get any recipes for them. Let's see what you have for sale today, too. I gotta get that piece of candy. Let me craft my axe before I forget. And then we will buy our piece of candy. crafting because I think I could do the shovel now as well and then we'll just get the wood the soft wood soft wood for that I never did get all of the golden tool recipes on my old save file um, <clears throat> I only had the axe slingshot and watering can so that'll be a goal to try for this go around what you got? What you got for sale? Oil barrel, picnic basket. Um, I'm gonna pass. Get my candy. Only one per customer per day. That's fine. I only have two villagers. Maybe I'll have three or four by Halloween, but we're kind of Cutting it close there. What's today? The 27th. So, yeah. Yeah, let's see what else. I know I need a swimsuit. Blue sparkler, red mum, red rose, white cosmos. Slingshot, I have. I have it. I have it. Okay, we've got all of that. I want to see how much the pocket organizer is. I think it's 8,000.
Yeah, I need I need all the things. So, okay, 3000 for the better tools. The tool ring is only 800, but I'm okay without that right now. I, oh, it's only 5000 for the pocket organization guide. Sold. Redeem. I see, this totally makes sense. I learned some tricks for organizing my belongings. I bet I can carry a bit more stuff now. Oh, yes, look at all of that yummy space. Okay, let's go back to chopping trees. Let's hope I remember which ones I shook. <laughs> Otherwise, we'll just have to see how fast I can run. I thought maybe the, thought the rain was letting up a bit. Okay. You know what? <laughs> Way to go there, big swinger. I'm going to um, leave the wood just sitting around the base of the trees so I don't uh, chop things twice. I don't want to wear out my axe too fast. Oh, there we go. Got some Nook Miles Plus. So I need to catch four more bugs, plant a fruit tree, sell fruit. That's easy. Well, that all crafting I'll do when I break something. Oh, hit rocks. Nice. Let's see. This will be for the snail I just caught. I'm telling you, my depth perception is off. <laughs> okay, let's gather this. Let's go ahead and hit this. Hey, I remembered which direction. Did I shake this tree? I don't know. Let's just get this one while we're here. And I'm also going to hit the rocks. Let's see if I can remember. Wait, did I make a shovel? I did. Okay, Let's see if I remember the little trick with the holes. One there, one there. And that should do it. Oh, yeah, I should get the bug, but I'm not going to. <laughs> I wanna get my little, oh, I didn't get all my hits, or did I? Uh, I got enough for it to count. Got to start building up those Nook Miles again. Let's get some money ready to plant for the money tree. Gather up my wood. fish. I should catch it. Look, I dug up 1,000 bells. Okay, well let us put that 1,000 bells away and then bury this in the hole. I think that'll grow where it is. It's not too close, I don't think, to the pond. I guess I'll know by tomorrow. I should probably just move it to my house so I don't lose track of what tree is where. But I think I'll remember it by the pond. Okay. Let's hit this rock too while we're here. Maybe we'll get lucky and find the money rock. Hey, hey, hey. Sorry, little bug. You get, to, well, I guess not sorry. You get to run free. I'm not going to catch you, capture you yet either. Hey, I got all eight that time. Rock splitting champ. Oop. 
Let's see what else we have here. Pay dirt. Oh, now I can go get the uh, tool ring. <laughs> I was looking away for a second. I thought I heard my cat heading this way. The one, little Miss Scarlet, who you heard yowling in the background during my entire last video. <laughs> She's still asleep. We're safe. Let's get some, I think I had a thing to sell fruit, right? Yes. Oh, and plant some fruit. I could get that by planting the apples. I'll be right with you, Leaf. I have to do something first. Need some bells so I can buy some pumpkin starts. I think I'll just plant them next to my house. I want to sell. Cherries, and that's all. <laughs> Okay. Oh, I know, I wanted to make some little log stakes. I thought maybe um, I could put a little garden for the pumpkin starts by my house. Maybe, since I can't do fences yet, it'd be cute if I put some log stakes around it. So let's go see what I need for crafting those. Just want a couple, like a little divider for the yard or something. Oh, cool. That was one change I wish we had seen for the 2.0 update is, and I don't think there was, um, being able to craft more than one thing at a time. I mean, I know you can press the A button a couple times to make it go faster, but eh. <laughs> it'd be nice to queue up multiples. Let's see if there's anything else I want to craft. I know my vaulting pole. Just enough softwood for that. Is there anything else? No, I was going to maybe do a little birdhouse. We'll do more later. Oh, that's right. Nook Miles Plus for crafting. Oh, and let's get the uh, tool ring while we're here. Yep, I want the tool ring before anything else. See, this totally makes sense. I learned how to easily switch tools. When I'm outside, I can press the... Is it called a D-pad? I'm such a dork. I don't even remember if that's what the thing on the controllers is called. <laughs> I, I, I know I said I've been gaming for like 20 years, but I've mostly been playing things like World of Warcraft and The Sims. Well, that The Sims was my very first game. I actually haven't played that in a few years. I've been playing World of Warcraft for what feels like forever and a few other things. And so nothing that really used a controller. So the Nintendo Switch uh, Joy-Cons and the Pro Controller are the first controllers I have used in I don't know how many years, a decade at least. So anyway, when I'm outside, I can press the little doohickey thingy there to use the tool ring now. <laughs> Oh, there's my full dorkdom on display. Okay, hey, back up to 1400. Nook Miles, not bad, not bad. Oh, that would be Miss Duchess, I think. Our other dog, his name is Prince Rootbeer. He is still sleeping. 
But I think we're gonna just buy some pumpkins. What should I call you, friend? Moxie! Did you say Moxie? What a happy name. Oh yes, and I'm Leaf. I heard that my good old, my good pal Timmy moved out here, so thought I'd pay him a visit. Timmy told me this was a deserted island before you moved here. What a happy adventure. I bet you were up to your ear holes and weeds when you first arrived. I still am, Leaf. I may be gathering some later on today to sell to you. I hope some of the rare flower seeds and shrubs I brought with me will be featured in your final masterpiece. Me too. I recommend lining them up around your house, along with flowers, of course, for the best effect. You can't go wrong when you surround yourself with such beauty. By the way, today I'm selling... Whoa, it sounds like my dog just <laughs> fell off the sofa. By the way, today I'm selling the happiest shrub I know, the tea olive. Oh, those are pretty. And lucky for us, it's currently in season, so we don't have to wait to appreciate its lovely blossoms. Oh yes, I also brought some wonderful little pumpkin starts that I'd love to sell to you. And since October and Halloween are such close friends, they're on sale for half off. Just a few days after planting, my pumpkin starts, you'll have cheerful pumpkins, eager to be picked. Yes, watering them makes them happier. Okay. Pumpkins are so much fun. I sure hope you'll try raising some. I will. I hope to see you again, too. Like, right now, so I can buy some pumpkins. Is it just me, or are they all repeating things to me today? <laughs> I'm here to shop. Okay, I'm gonna... I do like the camellias. Uh, let's get some... Let's get... Um, ten pumpkin starts. That's probably more than I need. I do have a few pumpkins sitting on my husband's island waiting for me as well, but let's, yeah, let's do ten. Five more, please, and then I'll get some camellias. Although, I don't think they bloom for a while. I think we're coming into holly bush season, so I'm going to hold off on buying any shrubs. Let's see what flowers. I do like hyacinths. I hadn't paid attention. I don't know what my flowers are. Red, white, and yellow. Let's just buy a little of everything, I guess. <laughs> okay, get some white. And some yellow. Uh, five more of those, please. I think that's all I'm going to get for now. I'll save tulips for another time. That will do it. Thank you, Leaf. I think, let's see, this video, we've been going for almost just a little over 40 minutes. I'm going to end it right here. I've been trying to keep them around the 30 to 45 minute range. I feel like that's a pretty good, a good time frame. Um, I'm probably going to play a little bit more off camera just to get some things planted. Um, and I want to, it's probably going to take me about an hour and a half to two hours to go back and forth between my island and my husband's island to get uh, my hybrids and some of the items and all the bells and nook mile tickets I have littering his island. So I'm going to do that off camera. That would be really boring to watch. So we're going to end it here and we will pick it up tomorrow. Uh, look forward to playing for you guys some more then. So everyone have a good afternoon. Take care.